Welcome, Scorpio. Thank you for tuning in to your horoscope for February 19, 2024, on your channel, Zodiac Attraction. Discover what the future holds for you in terms of finances, lucky numbers, love, health, work, family, compatibility, and favorite color. Subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on daily updates. Get ready to explore your destiny. Let's get started. You may find yourself questioning activities that you used to enjoy, but now feel are not leading you toward well-being. Pay attention to what really makes you feel alive, excited and connected to your essence. The key is in the energy that emanates from each choice and experience in your life. The angels assure you that there is nothing to worry about. Life guides you toward joy, success, and abundance, as long as you take a moment to discern what you truly need in this present moment. Let go of external expectations and immerse yourself in a deep connection with yourself. A journal can be your ally on this journey, helping you discover your true desires and goals. Remember that lover energy manifests when you are unclear about a relationship, a job opportunity, or any aspect that affects your abundance. Emotional clarity is the key, so if something doesn't make you feel abundant, joyful, and blissful, you already have your answer. The universe is guiding you towards a period of great joy and success, represented by the Sun card. You don't need to wear yourself out trying to figure out or force things. Instead, focus on understanding and feeling what you really want right now. Journaling can be your tool for this journey of self-discovery. Remember to honor the needs of your body, as this is your physical temple. Listen to their messages and attend to their needs, allowing yourself to be open to receiving the blessings that the universe has prepared for you. Commitment to yourself will lead you to live a full and exciting life. The affirmation of the day is, I honor the needs of my body. By doing so, you open yourself to a flow of positive energy that leads you towards love, abundance, and joy. The universe reminds you that you have all the time you need to live a life full of love and be loved wildly. Make the most of your Sunday by fully embracing play, dear Scorpio, as the Gemini's moon nudges you to blow off steam with friends. Excitement fills the air when Luna and Uranus align this afternoon, and acting impulsively with someone special could strengthen romantic bonds. Lean into these vibes by sneaking away with your sweetheart for an adventurous date, or consider exploring new dating opportunities if you're on the hunt for love. Romantic vibes continue to flow when Venus activates this evening, granting permission to don rose-colored glasses. Your creative mind ignites as the day ends and Neptune stirs. Many good opportunities are awaiting you. But they require a great deal of commitment which seems to be an unavailable option for you at this point of time. It is okay for you to put this opportunity on hold for an important personal event. You are gentle in your disposition and this is what helps you gel softly with friends. Start binging HGTV shows, Scorpio. You might throw yourself into a decluttering and home improvement project for the next three weeks as beautifying Venus glides through trailblazing Aquarius and joins Make It Happen Mars your domestic quarters. From now until March 11th, your fantasy world will revolve around tidy bookshelves, rolling up your shirts and underwear and maintaining a spotless kitchen. And really, Scorpio, for your streamlined sign, having an organized, and beautiful, home and workspace is better, and cheaper, than therapy. You might discover ways to improve your family and home life or your relationship with yourself and your inner world, dear Scorpio. There's certainly a stronger focus on domestic or personal matters in your life, and it makes sense to think up ways to smooth out and boost this life department. Fortunately, you could now come into the resources or support to do so. Sound advice can leave you feeling more secure and emotionally together. It can be a time to deal with information or recent reveals and make the most of them your need to observe and reflect kicks in strongly today. As you feel more comfortable with your inner world, you might arrive at a good place to understand your past or deeper feelings. Remember, life has exciting adventures in store for you. Don't worry, just immerse yourself in fun and exciting experiences. 
Angels and universe send you their love. Until the next reading. Today's tarot reading for your sign. Card of the day, Eight of Swords. Today, Scorpio, you find yourself facing the Eight of Swords, a card that suggests certain self-imposed limitations or external influences that could be affecting your perspective. It's like you feel like there are open paths, but something in your environment or someone's words is making you question your decisions and feel trapped. The energy of Gemini, represented by the lover's card, indicates that you may be faced with important decisions related to love or relationships. You may feel the need to evaluate your choices and perhaps question whether you are following the right path. Council of the Universe, Seven of Wands. The Seven of Wands emerges as the message from the universe, highlighting the importance of standing your ground and defending your ideals. Even if you face challenges or resistance, the card suggests that persevering and being ambitious in your goals will be rewarded. You may find someone in your environment, possibly an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, who may be expressing envy or discord. Maintain your determination and do not let yourself be affected by negative energies. Influences on Decisions, Ace of Wands The Ace of Wands emerges as an unexpected surprise, signaling that you could find yourself at a crossroads where you must make a sudden decision. This choice could have a significant impact on your current situation, but it can also open up new opportunities. Keep an open mind and prepare to be surprised. Aspects to Clarify, Five of Pentacles The Five of Pentacles card suggests that you may experience moments of exhaustion and feel tired. It may be related to financial matters or a feeling of loss in some aspect of your life. It is essential to remember that, despite the challenges, help is available, whether in the form of guidance, advice, or emotional support. Future Outlook, Ten of Wands Looking ahead, the Ten of Wands indicates a significant burden that you must carry. You likely have multiple responsibilities and pending tasks, but the letter warns about the importance of organization and planning. Although you may feel overwhelmed, remember that this period of intense loading is temporary, and the second half of the month could bring relief and substantial improvements. Final Tip, Labyrinth Stealth the sigil of the Labyrinth card reveals a transformative and ascending energy. This sigil urges you to raise your consciousness and overcome current challenges. It may indicate that you are on the path to enlightenment and resurgence. It is a reminder that, despite apparent difficulties, you are evolving and moving towards a higher level of understanding and well-being. In short, Scorpio, you face important challenges and decisions today, but the universe urges you to maintain your determination. Careful planning and resilience will be key to overcoming obstacles. Even though you may feel tired, there is light at the end of the tunnel, and the sigil of the labyrinth suggests that you are on an upward journey toward greater understanding and well-being. Trust your inner strength and move forward with determination. Now we will tell you how it will go with money and luck, but first remember to give us a like, subscribe to the channel and activate notifications, this helps us a lot and so you never miss your daily reading. Money and Luck Do you want to do something more fulfilling, Scorpio? There could be a strong urge to follow a more creative direction when the moon in Gemini's sextiles Uranus in Taurus. You might have a wonderful idea that you could pursue or a talent that you could use in your career path. There might even be an ongoing passion project to capitalize on. Since you have an unexpected chance to take a risk, you may as well go for it. After all, you never know what could happen unless you give it a try. It's time to change your perspective and see things from a new point of view. Trusting others is important at this time and trusting yourself is essential. Use your good judgment to know who you can trust and who you can't. Go with your feelings and your intuition. Your intuition will not lead you astray. Take time today to listen to the voice of your inner self and remind yourself that you are capable of achieving anything you set your mind to. The tarot gives you your lucky number. Your lucky numbers for February 19th are 26, 31, 45, 22, 18, 7. 
Daily love. You are extremely tied to the lunar cycles, Scorpio. As a sensitive and passionate water sign, you easily know how to ebb and flow. The moon holds tremendous dominion over mankind as her cycles wax and wane and show us patterns in our lives. New moons always dawn after the sun and moon unite in perfect alignment. The moon is always at her darkest phase before inching forward to the light. These times of the month encourage you to plant seeds in your life that you'd like to reach culmination in the entire year before you. Embrace the momentum now. Is it easy for you to experience intimacy with your romantic partner? What are the things that scare you the most in your partnership that may be preventing you from experiencing as much closeness and depth with your lover? Ask yourself these important questions today as the moon is in Gemini and in your eighth house. True intimacy is being able to share those darker or less happy parts of yourself with your significant other. Unfortunately, this is something we are not conditioned to do, we are told directly or indirectly by society that there are parts of ourselves that are best not to be shared with others, because otherwise they will leave us or judge us. Therefore, this is a great time for you to practice bringing more of that dialogue between you and your partner, making sure that both of you feel safe and trust one another to bring those aspects of yourselves into the partnership. At work. The day is best suited for speculative ventures. Buy a lottery ticket or invest in stocks and share today and you have a high chance of hitting the jackpot. You may also get a good tip from someone and if you act timely on it, you can significantly increase your income. You will enjoy a calm and peaceful day at work. What is the current nature and condition of your joint financial partnerships and investments? The moon is in Gemini today and in your eighth house, and it is asking you to reflect just on that. Do your investments give you back as much as you put into them? That is what determines whether it is an area of your life that deserves your energy and attention or not. Do not waste your time pouring your soul into something that will not provide you with a fair and just reward. Make sure that those whom you're in financial partnership are coming from the same place as you and seeking the same outcomes. Both parties have to be willing to give as much as they expect to take or receive. Health. You can sustain minor falls or injuries today or you may be susceptible to allergic reactions. Small accident is on the cards. So, you need to be extra careful. Otherwise, it is going to be an uneventful day. You may be visiting someone in a health center. This is also a good time to introduce some long-needed changes in your lifestyle. Under this planetary energy, it's time to focus on balancing your relationships. Spend time with close friends or loved ones and work on resolving any lingering issues. Try some restorative yoga or meditation and incorporate calming crystals like amethyst and rose quartz into your self-care routine. Family and friends. Watch out for your temper. You may lash it out on someone close to you. Partner may get hurt with your temper. Try explaining your partner that it was the outburst of some feelings that were ignored in past. Wear blue in some part of your clothing. Try controlling your emotions and if uncontrollable, watch the intensity at least. Home is where the heart is, and for the next four weeks the rest of you will be there as well. Loving Venus starts her annual transit of your emotional fourth house of home and family today, and while you'll want to use this transit to beautify your dwelling, you'll also want to bring that special someone home with you instead of going out on the town. Yes, your sign definitely needs its downtime even if you don't like to admit it, and during this transit you'll be more interested in having date night on the couch with takeout than hitting up the clubs looking for Mr. or Mrs. right now. Compatibility at work Pisces. In love Taurus. In luck Aries. Your lucky color today. Dark brown. We love that you get to this part of the video, don't forget to subscribe, like it and leave us your comments, at Zodiac Attraction we always read them and see you tomorrow, have a nice day.